This is a performance report on the Gameco Commander 3 IDBI and Shelly and Sands of Zanesville, Ohio. The Gomeco Commander 3 4 track with an independent attachment for providing dowel bar insertion for transverse joints. The IDBI is self contained and self powered. It's a synchronized system with any new Gomeco paver. This Commander 3 has taken on several projects for Shelley and Sands, but its primary mission is the paving of ramps. When we were on the project, one ramp was started in the afternoon and the other was started the next morning. There's a total of eight ramps on the project. The Commander 3 is paving 16 feet wide and 11 and a half inches thick. There's a center bar inserter on the front of the paver, placing bars every 26 inches for the longitudinal joint. The Commander 3 has hydraulic side-mounted bar inserters on each side, shooting bars every 18 inches into the edge of the slab. The IDBI is placing 16 bars on 12-inch centers across the width of the slab. And the transverse joints are every 15 feet. Before Shelly and Sands had their Commander 3 IDBI, they had to place dowel baskets on the grade during the paving operation because there was no room for a haul road. The process required more laborers, more materials, and more time to finish a single ramp. We visited with Johnny Van Dyne, the paving crew foreman. He said it used to take 12 to 14 hours to set baskets and pave a single ramp. Now they do it in four or five hours. We had, that's what we was just, actually all the guys was just talking about. That ramp that we, we're doing right now, we should be done in about a half hour, 45 minutes, 700 yards. That would have took us 12 to 14 hours, setting dial bar baskets, high bars, really saved a lot of time. Good. Yeah, as opposed to how much time today? Uh, we're going to have about five hours in a total slipping. We're, well, we did two ramps Tuesday, and we did 1,200 cubic yards, about 2,000 feet, plenty of feet. Uh, we had a job on 250. We was doing 12, 12 foot wide with the IDBI, 8 inches thick, and we was running 4,400 plenty of feet, 12 foot wide. And, about 11 hours. A crane is on board the Commander 3, which allows bar bundles to be loaded into the bar storage box. The crane features a wireless remote control to give the crane operator the freedom to be in the best position for operation and safety. The cycle of the IDBI has to keep up with the paver travel speed. Yeah, yes, we haven't had a problem with it yet. Not keeping up. Yeah, we we get we can get up. We get a little bit of wet concrete. We can get up to 12 to 15 feet a minute. The bars are loaded into the bar loading trolley. 16 bars were loaded on this project. The unique Gomeco trolley system discharges the bars into the individual bar holding trays. The trays are set at exact spacing per specification for the bars. The insertion forks then return to the standby position. Our patented insertion forks are designed to provide the industry standard in bar placement accuracy. The insertion begins with the firing of the IDBI. 
the forks reduce the amount of scarring on the insertion. And vibration enhances consolidation of material around the bars. Gomeco's exclusive computer-controlled smart cylinder technology provides the state-of-the-art system to maintain the accountability of the depth of the bars at the end of the insertion process. The bar tray never touches the concrete and the paver never stops for the insertion process. The IDBI travels on a rail at the paver's speed and the on-the-go process enhances writability and production. Johnny said that they get the accuracy with the IDBI. What about uh, accuracy of the bars? Have you checked anything? Yes, accuracy has been wonderful too. We've, I had all my state guys, I mean I usually show them right off the bat you know, how we string it and get our depth, and then we'll dig up a couple here and there just to just to visually check them. They're, they've been great. Uh, we actually shoot plastic tubes at the end for our runoff headers. We'll saw it off, epoxy the bars in, and they're, they're, per, they're almost perfect. Following the IDBI is a tamper bar system and a unique oscillating straight edge. And the IDBI system finishes up with the finishing pan and the Gameco stainless. And of course the Gameco edge, the edge that is the standard in the industry. This has been a performance report on a Shelley and Sands project with the Gameco Commander 3 IDBI, the solution for paving ramps. Gomeco, the worldwide leader in concrete paving technology. <laughs>